guess we'll go up here to see Usaidi. There you are. Here I am. Come on, let's go. Let's go where? Why are you so riled up? Today is a great day, Arthur. Today is the day they are going to hang Colm O'Driscoll. That's uh, so. Rather they hang him or I shoot him. Oh, they are gonna hang him. Yeah, and not before time. That boy's been on the gallows more than most. I wouldn't count anything until his neck's broke. Well, nor would I. Which is why... Despite us being wanted men, we're gonna attend the event ourselves. And follow him onto the scaffold? Well, let's hope not. But if I could see that son of a bitch breathe his last, I think I'd die a happy man. We are gonna disguise ourselves. In this? In this. Huh. Wow, we're gonna be some coppers. Okay. Come on. I don't know if I like this. Well, don't we just look the part. We'll cut through the alley to get to the gallows. We keep our weapons holstered, our disguises on, and our wits about us. Mrs. Adler, might I say, being a fancy woman of sand and he shoots you. <laughs> I'd dress up like the Queen of Sheba if it meant seeing that son of a bitch sway. Colm hung me up. Nearly butchered me. I don't mean I'm comfortable in this woolen coat. You made it out of that predicament, as I remember, Mr. Morgan. My husband weren't so lucky. You lost your husband. I lost my darling Annabelle. That poor boy, Kieran. We've all lost something because of Colm. Yes, we have. And that is why we will shepherd him to eternity. Amen to that. Now keep those fingers off those triggers, because we'll need cool heads and calm dispositions to see this done. <laughs> Practice what you preach, brother. Whatever do you mean? Are you going to keep your cool? Really? When you seem to lose it all so often now. This doubting and questioning of yours, I miss the old Arthur. Don't I miss we the all? old Dutch. Hey, you two quit it. Y'all got a job to do. We're all in rough agreement about how we're doing it, as far as I can tell. Exactly. We'll get it done, all right. All right, then. Come on. We got a hanging to witness. Look here. Don't the public love an execution? See that pair of assholes? Sure. They're Combs boys. Yes, I think so. What a surprise. I'm glad we're here. What are they pointing at? I don't know. We gotta follow them and find out. Yeah. Oh, here comes somebody. Stay here. Don't do nothing. Go brush that horse, officer. Yes, sir. <laughs> the crowd came to see a show. We don't want to disappoint them. I guess they did miss their chance to see John swing by his neck. Hey, hey. You know I wasn't going to let it come to that. Well, I guess I don't know what I know no more. And I guess this isn't the time to question either my decisions or yours. Here and now, Como Driscoll's going to get his due. He's turned down there. Let's go. Quiet. Where's the footlights? Where's the cop? 
cops. How many? Enough. So what do you think? Call's up on the roof. Once he starts shooting, we'll have to have our wits about us and move fast. Yeah. I guess we faced worse than this before. Sure. Get to it. Yeah. Can you believe Henderson's putting up the so, again? They got a guy up on the roof overlooking the gallows. Find a way up there on one of these verandas through a building maybe and get him and do it silently. Well, obviously I'm going to do it silently. I want to see this bastard swing. itself can at times be barbaric. For sometimes a man is so savage, the only way to deal with him justly is by savagery. Colm O'Driscoll is one such man. He has murdered, tortured, robbed, stolen, raped, and abused for a decade across five states, seemingly with impunity. Today, justice catches up with him. <laughs> As well you may. I've been a bad man. Silence! These charges... This is not a court where you shall be tried. This is a place where your sentence is to be carried out. And your sentence, Colm O'Driscoll, is that you are to be hanged by the neck until you are dead. This is not a task we take lightly. It is not a task we enjoy. But it is a task we must carry out if our civilization is to prosper. Gentlemen, are we ready? You going to swing, boy? Colm O'Driscoll. May God, in his infinite wisdom, have mercy upon your soul. Whenever you are ready. <laughs> now you know how it feels to watch something you love die. You ruined my life! Oh my goodness. Damn you, Sadie. Where?
go. I'm back home. Get on, Arthur. Well, <clears throat> and we saw the bastard hang okay. <laughs> 